think it's pretty amazing that we collected all these bags in just a week. And taking the environment into their own hands, Winnipeg school kids launch a campaign to recycle plastic bags. From Global Winnipeg, the evening news with Peter Chura and Eva Kovac. Good evening, thanks for joining waiting for the politicians to finally decide what to do about the bags blamed for clogging local landfills. They're part of a massive citywide effort to collect discarded bags and get rid of them. Global's Lindsay Warner reports. Reduce, reuse, recycle. When a challenge was sent out to elementary schools across the city to collect plastic bags, the green team at Crestview School stepped up. I think it's pretty amazing. We collected all these bags in just a week. The team of grade four and five students has dedicated countless hours to helping the environment. Their latest project was a two-week school-wide initiative to recycle plastic bags and keep them out of the landfill. It takes about a thousand years for one bag to um, disintegrate, but there's still pieces of it left. They would just go in the wild and harm animals. It would help the environment get better and it would stop global warming. What started as a simple idea to collect and recycle plastic bags has now snowballed into a citywide initiative. Over 88 schools across the city have signed up for the challenge. After the bags are collected, they'll be shipped to a plant in Ontario where they'll be remanufactured into Frisbees for the students. It's absolutely incredible what the kids are doing and what they're learning about recycling and about reducing the amount of plastic bags that are out there. BFI Canada has partnered with Take Pride Winnipeg for the project, recognizing plastic bags as a serious problem. Thousands, millions. Uh, I go to landfill every day, and that's all you see is, is, is plastic bags. BFI says it will be three days before they will be able to pick up the estimated 400,000 plastic bags from schools across the city. And while they don't expect the two-week project to solve the problem, they agree every little bit helps. Because if like this one school does it, then if a bunch of school schools do it, then like we could get millions of bags recycled. Lindsay Warner, Global News. Last week, City Hall's powerful executive policy committee ordered city staff to come up with some options for limiting the number of plastic shopping bags in the city. That could include a, a fee for use or an outright ban. Every meal of every day.